Hello everyone. Welcome to this video. My name is Lisa and I am answering a question from a, a subscriber who is asking a question that I've heard many times. So I figured I'll just do a video about it. And that question was, is narcissism something that you're born with? Is it genetic or is it a learned behavior? Okay. So I'm going to tell you right now that experts that study this and you know try to learn about it all the time have very different differing um, opinions about it so there are some that's going to say yes it's genetic others are going to say no it was learned all right so i'm just going to give you my perspective um, i i do know a lot about narcissism and i have studied a lot about narcissism the one thing that that puts me sort of in a unique position with this is, um, as I have meant to mentioned before, I'm, I am adopted. So the parents that I grew up with um, are not my biological parents. We also adopted my brother, who's two years younger than me. And of course, he and I are not biologically uh, related to each other. And he's not biologically related to my parents. So the two of us grew up in the same household with the same parents. We went to the same school. There was neither one of us was favored over the other. And um, I can tell you that when my brother was small, when he was very little, he was um, he was very sweet. Um, it always seemed like there was maybe something with him because he was in foster care much longer than I was. My parents got me at nine weeks. They got my they got my brother at like six months because he had something that they called at the time failure to thrive. So I'm not sure if that made a difference or not. But I do remember being small with him and him being just so wonderful and I just loved him to death. However, when he reached his preteens, um, you know, to teenage years, a, a few things happened. One, he got his first sip of alcohol. From that moment on, he was alcoholic. Okay. Um, and I would be willing to bet that one of his biological parents is also alcoholic. Neither one of my parents I, is a narcissist. Okay. They're anything but. They were anything but that. And however, my brother is not only an alcoholic, he is also a narcissist. He is one of the worst. I, before I knew, you know, what to call the stuff. I mean, as far as being like a pathological liar and, and literally telling you, you said something that you didn't, the whole gaslighting, like I didn't have the language for that, but I recognize that. And so, for me personally, I think it can be genetic. I, I really think it can. I also think that it could, that um, your environment plays a huge role. So as someone who did not meet their birth parents until I was 30 years old, obviously my personality was already developed. And obviously I could see, you know, physical, you know, similarities, um, certain mannerisms and, you know, even just certain traits that not even knowing them, I inherited that. I can also see the things that I inherited from my parents that raised me. So I can't tell you for sure which way it is. However, what I do know for sure is that the, a person becomes a narcissist during their childhood. It is going to be before the age of 10. And, there, and therefore, if you met that narcissist and they were up in their 20s or older than that, they were already a narcissist. It was already there. Um, my brother is someone who has physically, verbally, and every other way abused women. He never watched my father do that. My father never screamed at my mother. My father never threatened my mother and vice versa. So where did that come from? Okay, so this is just my take on it. I'm glad to know your opinions on this. Um, I guess the thing is, what I focus most on is, are they a narcissist? And if so, I want to get away from them. Bottom line. 